Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. I am Nonji Malunga for those of you who do not know me. And I'm back with another vlog. I'm back with a day in my life, week in my life slash weekend vlog. Um, I realize that most of the vlogs I post on this channel are like when I go somewhere, but I wanted to just mix things up and um, have a vlog where I'm just living my life and basically doing nothing. But I have a few things planned. Um, I have to find a dress for um, a wedding I'm going to. I have some admin. I'm going to see my friends. But literally the purpose of a vlog is for you to watch and basically find out what I get up to. So yeah, basically this is what this vlog is going to be about. And yeah, let's just get straight into it it. So I'm basically still home. I'm trying to finish off editing these two vlogs that I had one where I went to Durban and the other one where I went to um, this hotel in Joburg South. So right now this thing is saying missing file. I'm so stressed because I spent the past hour trying to edit this vlog. But if you guys haven't watched these videos, please, please watch these videos after you finish watching this one. So right now i want to go to the mall so it's a friday i'm literally done with work we had a half day at work today so i was done at one o'clock it's currently four o'clock so i want to go to the mall to get a dress i'm gonna wear to my brother's wedding in december so um i need a traditional dress and a white wedding dress the traditional one i'll get it made so that's fine because we have to use um specific material and all of that but my issue is the white wedding dress so i know there's like two boutique stores um at santon city and there's one at rosebank where i got this dress so i'm gonna go to rosebank tomorrow but today i'm just gonna try these stores and see if i find anything and i'd rather i can get both dresses made but i'd rather um buy one of them so at least i'm happy i know how it looks on me and in jay i have no surprises when it's a week before i still don't have a dress or it's a week before and the dress is a total total disaster so yeah i think i'm just gonna buy one of them hopefully i find something so now i'm just gonna go off to santon city and then hopefully we can find something okay so i'm off to santon city now the name of the boutique is called paloma boutique i think um and basically they do like one or two dresses per design so um even if you find this perfect dress but it's not in your size then it's not in your size you have to look for another dress which is quite sad but it's nice because you know that there won't be like 10,000 of you guys wearing the same dress so i'm gonna try it out and hopefully they got something for me because it's gonna be pretty sad not this immediately know guys nothing is working i just realized i probably have to make the dress because <laughs> what was that it's so crazy um the options were so bad i'm not even gonna go to the other store because i realized they probably won't have what i want guys yo first of all they didn't have sizes all the dresses they had left they had lived you know, were just very very average so i'm i'm actually probably gonna make a dress now i just have to think of a design and everything i'm gonna try the rose bank um shop tomorrow if not i've decided that i have to make a dress because 
I just saw Uguti, I'll never actually find what I'm looking for because I never ever do anyway. So I'm quickly rushing home. I'm gonna get ready to go out for supper with my friend. Um, it's October, what is it called? Restaurant week which is the entire month which is so annoying because why don't they call it restaurant month uh, instead of week so um by the time i post this it's gonna be november probably so restaurant week would be over so you guys must catch it next weekend um but y'all let me get home and get ready and then we all oh. um, we chose a restaurant um called inside to restaurants i think it's inside a, a hotel or something like that but we'll just see when we get there so i'm um, already now we are very very late i'm gonna pick her up then we're gonna go straight to the restaurant so pretty excited it's a three course meal and yeah chat about it when we get there so we've just arrived it's literally um half past no it's 10 past seven our reservation was of what your our reservation was for half past six so we are extremely late hopefully we'll still get a table but it looks really cute it's in Houghton Estate and yeah I'll show you guys it's a bit dark so I don't even know it's if you guys are gonna see my what do you mean by our reservation so we made it into the restaurant it's actually by uh it's actually inside a boutique hotel so it looks very very cute and petite so excited to see the menu now um so this is the menu very cute let me open it so it's a set menu three course meal and these are the options so we are about to go on a taste experience guys you must be friends with chefs they will show you things and take you places because i don't even know this place our spouses love the fish i'm not sure about that pasta but also i don't like tomato so maybe that's why but I tomato think. is literally in everything no this is really i love this this was absolutely delicious the papa the papa doesn't belong there though it doesn't belong there it's absolutely delicious. there's no link with why the... are you warming up people? like banana on pizza what are you what are you doing <laughs> why are the pineapples on pizza yeah welcome to the very next day so i went to a park run the one in Bryanston, and so when i checked online it said half past seven but it started at eight so when i get there i think that okay i'm late because i got there at like 7 30 on the dot so i'm like okay maybe they're extra and everybody starts early but it turns out that um um they actually started eight because when i was um coming back and about to finish i see a whole lot of people and i'm like please i'm supposed to be running with you guys but it was great um i always say running is therapeutic so i really really enjoy it so right now i'm just quickly gonna get ready and then as i said we're gonna try out that shop in rosebank so that's the first on the list if 
I feel I'm literally gonna go look for someone who can make the dress for me. Okay, so I just come from Rosebank Mall and it's looking promising. Uh, there was a few dresses I tried on, they weren't that bad. They said they were getting stocked later on today at like one o'clock. Um, I went there at like half past ten. So I'm just gonna go back tomorrow. Then if not, that is the final straw. Now I'm off to my friend's house, Sam. I haven't seen her in a while, so we're just gonna have some mimosas and catch up. Um, probably chill there for the afternoon. I'm not sure what we'll get up to, but it's raining now. We were meant to have a car date and wash our cars, but I guess we can't anymore because it's raining. So yeah, I'll chat to you guys when I get to Sam's house. So I made it to Sam's house. I haven't seen her since Greece, right? No, we went to prison break more. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that time I added a bit of that in like my previous vlog. So they'll be like, what the hell? You just saw her. <laughs> Here's Sam. Hey. And I got a package. I'm so excited to open it. Let me open it. Should have pulled my camera. And the thing is so hot, so. Which thing? Um, the shampoo. Pool. But I guess the juice can make it. So we just finished our first bottle of bottomless mimosas. Okay, it's not bottomless, it's one bottle. So we're going now to Woolworths uh, to get another one. It is currently load shedding, guys. South Africa is the absolute bottom. So it's load shedding. The UK shedding. is also getting load shedding. Really? Yes, in general. Okay, then, I mean, we're all going through these struggles. So, y'all know, load shedding. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to come back and chill in silence and meditate. Enjoy each other's company. Get yes. to know each other. Get to know us. <laughs> so guys, I can't imagine going to the office five days a week. And that used to be our normal life. Like, I go to the office three days a week. How many days do you go? Three mandatory days. Yeah, it's also three mandatory. And like the two days, which is Thursday and Friday, where I don't go to the office, I'm like, sure, I can breathe. You go to the office Monday to Wednesday. Right? Yeah, dude. But at least like you get it over and done with and it's over. And so then it's me, like a weekend. We don't have meetings. We have meeting free Wednesdays. Uh, so that's the day I stay home and then I stay home on Fridays obviously because it's Friday. Because it's Friday. Um so I do Mondays, Tuesdays and Thursdays. And Thursday. But like when I, I like I want to go back to KZN or like I have something, at least I can book from Thursday because that's it's true. like, you know, then it's like an extended. I mean weekend. you can always switch it as just Oh, online. so you guys can sw switch it. Yeah, you don't have oh. to go on the same no, day. No, us it's like marketing department Monday to Wednesday. Ah. Both are your yeah. We're just having one shot. Tell me why you're crying, no kidding, big girls. When you gave me something, I don't need spells. But you know that's already. So we've now changed locations. We're at the Mizi now. We're getting some Crocs because apparently Crocs is having Most a sale in, the, in the entire world. So they're literally going at half price, guys. So we're gonna check it out if it's real. Um, oh, the clothes. That's time they have like different. shading the people so we're trying to look for an inn but it looks like they ain't in it if the world was dead would you cry or would you try to get me tell me now i want you to be clear tell me now i need you to be clear Yeah, so it is a Monday morning 
Um, on Sunday, I just went to see my friend. He just bought a new place. Um, so I just went to chill with him. And yeah, I didn't do much yesterday. But basically, I wanted to show you guys the crocs that I got. So they were half price. They were literally, not even half price, more than half price. It was 60% off. So I got... I got for me and my family. So, ooh, one of these names. So I got white ones. And then I also got the, this color. Yeah. And then I got all the charms. So I got my full name. Then I also got NM. Then I got some weird stuff like this but yeah i'm glad i got the discount i think i'm gonna swap my white ones for brown ones because i feel like everybody has white and white has been overhyped and i don't like it when it gets dirty like okay i guess the browns are also lights but i think whites will work best so now i'm just getting ready for work um i don't wake up that early i wake up at like half past six but half past six is literally enough time for me to make food for work for me to like wash dishes and do a lot so we only had to be work uh, be at work at nine um and my work is 20 minutes away 15 minutes on a good day so like yeah i don't have to wake up extra early for work and then now i usually take my supplements in the morning so i've got an iron deficiency i don't know if you can see that so i have to take iron supplements then i also take some vitamin c and zinc and stuff and the iron thing is so crazy because the way i found out um so after i had covid i had like a lot of hair loss so i went to a, a dermatologist and then they're like okay let's just check um your your what is it called your your levels what are vitamins it's not vitamins let's check your your thing levels i forgot what it's called but from the results it came out that i am iron deficient and it makes a lot of sense because my colleagues are literally like dude how can you be tired every single day of your life so, so the iron supplements have definitely been helping me out so guys if you someone who's always tired and you do try workouts you do try eat healthy but you're still tired and you're not pregnant maybe you are you uh, have an iron deficiency and you should go get that tested so yeah i'm basically off to work as i said i'll go to work monday to wednesday the office is lame so there's nothing even to um show content of there but i guess this brings us to the end of our video i hope you guys enjoyed my mini weekend vlog i trust next time i'll try to do more um or actually film more because i did do quite a few things and yeah if you enjoyed the video please do um leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe it is free and yeah i'll catch you guys in the next video